Hi everyone, I'm Thibaut Ambert, Product Manager for the Adobe Flash Player. I'm very excited to be here uh, today and to uh, show you what we've been working on at Adobe uh, in the Flash runtimes uh, with the Molehill APIs. Technically, Molehill is a set of shadow-based 3D GPU APIs which exposes features like cube textures, z-buffering, uh, fragment and vertex shaders, and all that cool stuff. What's great for developers is that developers will be able to create high-end 3D advanced rendering in the Flash Runtime, Flash Player, or Air. And we also do provide, through the same API, uh, an engine which does the CPU fallback when hardware is incompatible. So it's very, very exciting. So here is the Max Racer demo that we just demoed at Max uh, during the keynote. And this demo is very, very exciting because it is using the new Molehill APIs, the GPU 3D APIs exposed in the Flash Runtimes. And this game has been developed by the Alternativa 3D guys um, uh, through a framework called Alternativa. And this new framework, Alternativa 3D 8, is built on top of uh, the Molehill API. So what's great for the community and developers is that you'll be able to build your own engine or use existing engine which are built on top of the Molehill APIs. So this game here, this is the splash screen. I have my car, uh, you know, here spinning. You can enjoy the nice environment mapping and reflection and all um, this nice 3D rendering. Um, you can see that actually the CPU usage is really, really low, uh, almost zero, zero percent here on my computer. So pretty cool stuff. Uh, everything is processed through uh, the GPU because internally Molehill is using OpenGL on Mac and Linux and DirectX on Windows. Um, Molehill is also able to uh, run on mobile devices, so that's very, very cool. Um, what uh, I'd like to do here is change, changing the color of my car. I'll change to something uh, red, like a uh, you know, flash, flash color, something red, like a flash Ferrari. And now we're going to get started. I have my uh, steering wheel connected to the computer, and I'm going to be able to use that steering wheel in my game and enjoy the nice 3D experience uh, uh, enabled through Molehill. So let's get started. So you see that nice 3D rendering and the reflection on my car. The performance is unbelievable. Um, this is flash player. This is amazing. And the whole 3D world here is actually, um, are actually the streets around the uh, max venue. So I'm going to try not go into the walls or trees. Let's do here some brakes. And I got the ramp here. I'm going to jump that. Nice physics uh, done through ActionScript. And you can stop a little bit and enjoy the nice details, you know, of the textures and the rendering. I can actually. Uh, show that view and you can see the car. It's really nice rendering and very nice experience. Uh, I can't imagine what people will do uh, with those those APIs. Um, so this um, demo has been running uh, at the booth and will be running actually at the at Max at the Adobe booth. So if you have uh, the chance to stop by, you can actually try that demo for real and we'll try to have that available also online very soon. So this is what I wanted to share with you. Uh, the new Molehill APIs is going to change actually how you know people work with 3D in the Flash runtimes. So uh, we are expecting to be uh, releasing uh, a beta uh, in the first half of 2011 so that you guys can test, provide feedbacks, uh, work on your frameworks, and you know create all those amazing 3D experiences with the Flash runtime. Thank you very much. So actually, you see that nice performance. Well, okay, we start. <laughs> We're going to redo it. <laughs>